Hello, this is Blake, and I'm going to explain to you the AI content management system for immigration returns. This is the home page. This is uh, what you see when you first come to uh, the URL of the site. And uh, when you log in, uh, you see your profile. Uh, very similar to this, uh, some of these top row buttons you may not see because I'm the uh, author of the site uh, and also administrator, I get a few more controls than, than you would get. On uh, the left sidebar contains any memos for any projects that you remember. Uh, projects are private and uh, this is not a social media website, so uh, you can't really post anything publicly. Everything is maintained private, and nobody sees your profile or sees any information that you've created on the site unless you invite them into a private project that contains that information. On the right sidebar is where uh, basic navigation buttons will appear. Uh, although whenever you're in a project, you'll have navigation buttons that appear at the top and bottom of the page. Uh, as just a general overview, you get uh, the different projects that you're a member of, and uh, you can, of course, create a project as many as you like. Uh, there's a quick start guide that just basically walks you through quickly how to create a project if you don't want to uh, watch videos like this or read more information. Uh, there's a note about privacy. Uh, here's the array of chatbots that you have access to. Uh, the top row of chatbots are uh, basically R&D conversational type chatbots where uh, you directly engage in conversation with them and they have expertise in different areas. Uh, all of it legal immigration expertise. The bottom row of chatbots are integrated into the word processor, spreadsheets, and uh, chat interfaces that you use that they uh, provide additional services, such as the memo bot uh, is uh, essentially a paralegal and professional writing advisor. Uh, the uh, memo editor bot uh, is similar, but he has HTML skills. Uh, the spreadsheet bot is uh, an expert at explaining how to use spreadsheets or how to use a given spreadsheet, uh, no matter how complex it is. And then the spreadsheet editor bot helps people create spreadsheets. And uh, then uh, in addition to these chat bots, there's a separate task bot interface, which is basically an editing interface to create more chat bots. And then they can also trade information back and forth collaboratively. And that's what task bot dictionaries are all about. And then uh, there's other administration functions. But uh, at this point, let's walk into the documentation project. The documentation project is essentially just it explains how to use the website. And uh, here's a project memo explaining how to use the rich media text editor and uh, uh, the ways that you can embed uh, uploaded files in and the methods in which you can use your own voice rather than typing. So you can use your voice to uh, create the memo. And you can also use your voice to talk to the AI when you request it to make modifications or when you ask it about the subject matter within the memo. And uh, of course, because this is a memo, there's an actual transcription to this automatically generated. A memo is any information related to the project that ought to be maintained and kept with the project. So as you can tell, that is this text up here. And uh, so here's the documentation project, and here's the documentation for a memo sheet. A memo sheet is really just a spreadsheet, but it has a 
rich description associated with it. And that description is used to tell an AI agent what the spreadsheet is for. And then together, the spreadsheet, its formulas, and the description are used to generate an expert in that specific spreadsheet. And uh, so that is really kind of the basics. Uh, you've got chat interfaces. When you first create a project, you've got your actual description area. What's the project for? You can create memos. You can create memo sheets. You can upload files. Uh, no files are uploaded here. You can create a memo sheet. Here's what a memo sheet looks like. It's just a spreadsheet with a text editor beneath. And then you've got a chat interface that you can type directly into here, or you can use your voice and generate what's coming, what's here or what's up here. And uh, then down here, you've got these uh, different chat bots that you can essentially engage in R&D uh, conversations, uh, asking them about uh, immigration issues. And uh, I will uh, get into that a little more in the next video.